Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Suikoden 5. We'll be on the lookout for any suspicious types. Just leave it to us and hurry on to Lunas. So, we can't go back into the, uh, uh, dawn room. We saw a very suspicious looking woman. Hey, there's a doggy back there. And a chest. Two doggies. Take the cape. Saw a very suspicious looking woman with a portrait, so clearly, uh, she's going to be an important later. Ruff, ruff. Uh, she also gave, uh, Sea leads and Jean run for her money. Run for their money, if you uh, know what I mean. Obtained glass slippers. Alright, let's, uh. Well, since we have to get around to the. Well, we don't have to get around to the front of the building, but I'm gonna get around to the front of the building again and then go in. Let's see if there's anything over here. Hello! Your Highness, Lady Sea leads, welcome to the East Palace. Please make yourselves at home. Received cheesecake! Cheesecake. So good. Oh, your highness, Princess Limzea. Many congratulations on your engagement. And greetings to you, your highness. Yeah, she's not all that happy about it. Um, where does this go? Oh. Sleep orb. Okay, I take back what I said in the last episode about them hiding chests. Well then. Still, I think that it'll be- it'll tend to be kind of obvious, like, in that case. Yeah, we talked to him already. I heard that you and Lady Sea Leeds were carrying out an inspection of Lord Lake recently, Your Highness. But those heathens don't deserve any kindness or attention from the royal family whatsoever. And you have- all you have to do is give the order, and we'll be glad to finish them all off. Fired. Get out. Excuse me, Your Highness, I got a little carried away there. My brother was a soldier too, you see, and he was killed when, in the uprising two years ago, Your Highness. That's why I... Uh, forgive me. Nope, fired. Get out. As you can see, the East Palace has been fully repaired now, but sadly it's still missing the Dawn Rune. We're doing absolutely everything in our power to recover it, but it's been fruitless so far. If the Dawn Rune has somehow found its way into Armas's hands, it would be a crisis of epic proportions. Don't you think they would have used it by now? Armas is a neighboring country to the east. You know, traditional enemy and all that. Does this go outside? No, it does not. Okay, goes to a room. After the uprising two years ago, the locals offered to help restore the palace. It was touchy to see how much they, uh, how much they obviously love and respect the queen. I just can't understand what those people from Lord Lake were so unhappy about. What sent them into a frenzy? Probably magic? I know it's not my place to say, but Queen Arshtad is a far far more benevolent ruler than those who came before her. That that actually seems like a reasonable thing to say. Okay, apparently we cannot go around the side of that bed. Or over there. There are a lot of invisible walls in this game. Alright, that looks like a door, but apparently it's not. You always keep the palace spotlessly clean. That way it's ready for royal visitors at any time. Oh, that's probably a good idea. Nothing to see here. What do we have upstairs? Oh. Lots of upstairs. I want that sword. Can I can I have the sword? No. Damn it. Next we have to go to the Holy Land of Lunas. It should be north and east north of the East Palace. Thanks, Leon. I, I, I gathered that. Both the East Palace and West Palace were built as vacation homes for the royal family. Even though, you know, it's like an hour's walk away. But they were also important places for the safe safekeeping of the runes. The Dawn Rune was housed here. Now that the rune has been lost, well, this place is like a shadow of its former self. Yeah, I don't know, I mean... Shadows are pretty long at dawn. I don't think there's any more, I think this uh, just goes back outside if we go straight through here. So, but let's check. Yep, that is the case. Alrighty, well... 
This does not seem like a very defensible place, though. Uh, I'm not surprised that uh, people were able to steal the room. Birdies! Oh, hey, there is a save point here. Let me go ahead and save. I didn't notice that on the way in. Should have come over here and saved it uh, in between episodes. Whatever. Alrighty, and, uh, let's see. Yep, it, uh, really mucked up our formation. Alright, uh, let's see. Reposition. There we go. That is okay. And... Let's take a look at equipment. Um, I'm not check what uh, Miyaki's has. All right, that just goes in there. She is wearing much better stuff than Leon, so let's do some swapping around. Let's unequip all of her stuff. Headpiece. Knight full armor. Knight gloves. We've got uh, glass slippers. We'll give those to uh, sea leads. Knight boots. So we picked up a cape. Um, I'll leave that unequipped. I'll give that to Sea Leads. Magic defense plus two. done this off screen, but uh, whatever. Uh, let's just go with best on Miyakis. Oh, I thought that was gonna... Okay. Uh, all best? Yeah, there we go. Uh, I do think that I want to equip that uh, scarf, though. Let's give that to someone else. should sell some of this stuff. I have a lot of junk. Um, I casual gear better for anyone? Do I have anything better for anyone else? No. Alright, scarf is good for anyone. Give it to Leon. We do not have better stuff for anyone. Oh, I uh, have an unidentified bonsai. I should do something about that. But that's okay, we'll do that later. Go ahead and leave. Um, that sleep rune that we picked up uh, has a uh, chance of inflicting um, sleep on enemies when you hit. Not all that useful, if you ask me. Um, let's see if we can wander around. There should be a uh, mini boss of a Peckles somewhere around here. Just auto. Not kill him, Sea Leads. I am disappointed. <laughs> oh, I cut off Miyakisa's laugh. Oh well. So I believe if we just follow the road, we'll get to Loomis eventually. But uh, I kind of want to look around to see if there's anything else that we can visit. I don't think there is, but uh... oh, hello, um, a wizard tree. I am actually not sure if this is a. Uh... Powerful attack, uh, uh, mini boss type thing, or not? Just auto. Ooh, nice critical hit. I mean, we've got uh, um, Georg. Yeah, just don't think that was. A thousand potch though. That's pretty good. All right, there's something down here. 
craft fleet. Hey, let's go in. This is not where we're supposed to be going, but uh, what's the worst that can happen? Pretty impressive, if you ask me. This is Raftly. Years ago, fishermen and merchants from all around started gathering here on the Fatus River. Over time, it's become a sort of floating town. It looks like fun! Let's go take a look! Totally! Absolutely not, Princess. Oh. The Queen would be furious if you made a side trip on the way back from a task like this. Way back? Oh, come on! Can't we go, please? Uh-oh. Um. Hmm. I guess it'd be alright. I knew you'd say yes, Al. You always understand. Are you sure? So I'll just tell Her Majesty that the Prince let you disobey her orders? Y you can't do that! Al will get in trouble! Oh, alright. I guess I just have to miss out on all the fun stuff. So, in other words, we can't do it anyway. Well, shucks. Oh, well. Uh, let me actually double-check something. Um, doo -doo -doo. I guess that wizard tree was a uh, mini-boss. Oh, well. I have no idea what this is. We can enter it. it looks like a bridge or some of some sort that's open at the moment. What's up? Until the uprising two years ago, this was just an average run-of-the-mill bridge. But during the uprising, the mob used it to get across the sea to the East Palace. There just wasn't anything stopping them. That's why we built this new bridge. We can make it revolve to our end, from our end, but it can't be controlled from the other side. If an uprising were to happen today, we'd be able to stop it no problem. Ah, Your Highness. Are you hoping to make use of the revolving bridge? Personally, I would love to show you the bridge in action, but I'm afraid it's not allowed. Sorry for the inconvenience. In other words, this is how we get we are prevented from uh, advancing in this direction. That is that is a gigantic gear. Or I guess that's more of a cog. So yes, we can't do anything uh, uh, this this way yet. All right, so north. I guess it's just across. Uh, oh, that's a big hill. I guess Lunas is just across uh, the field rather than along the road. Kind of figured that we'd have to follow the road for to get to Lunas, but uh, I mean, it seems like if you've got a tradition, nice going, Georg. You got a tradition. Ooh. <laughs> get sunbeam pieces from those things. Well, I picked up one already, so um, I don't need to get into three more fights that uh, two more fights that drop them. I need to pull out a map for this game. That's really what I need to do. Oh, I hate these things. Nice! You heard me! I like it. I got more creeper beads. I already have those already, so I'm just gonna sell those when I get to a town that I can sell them in. Another hill. There are a lot of rivers around here. Ah, yes, this is Lunas up here. Oh, hello, puppy! I hope we get, um... Oh, wow, those things have lots of points. They have a row attack? Well, that's just rude. Alright, that was, that was almost wasted, uh, uh Georg. Sunbeam piece? Damn it. Well, I got a few levels out of that. Is 
So we can't go anywhere else that way, it's just into the town, so let's go ahead and enter. Don't fall off. It sure is. So, this is the holy land of Lunas, huh? Sparkling water. I haven't been here what if since they Arshtad it? became queen, but it's just as beautiful as ever. I don't know, it's hey, awfully brown. Look at this! The water's so sparkly here! Is there something in the water? It's gold dust. What? You can find deposits of gold up the river from here. I've been waiting for you. Allow me to no, no time, myself. no time. Gotta go, uh, pan I'm for gold. Assistant. The Oracle instructed me to come meet you. Huh? You're, oh, that's, that's great. Let's be rude. Let's totally be, be rude. Huh? Your ears. Yes, yes, he's an elf. Indeed, I'm an elf. That isn't a problem, is it? Oh, don't mind him. We just don't... We just don't meet many elves, that's all. It's not my place to mind or not mind. It would be... It would be pointless to trouble yourselves over my feelings. Really? This way, please. The Oracle has been anticipating your arrival. Alright, let's, uh... Jump back. Sorry for the trouble. I wonder if someone else will uh, say something about the ears. Not at all. It is part of my duty. This way, please. The Oracle has been anticipating your arrival. I guess not. Oracle? The boss around here. Well, let's not keep the Oracle waiting. Misato joined the party. Really? Oh, I was not expecting that. Yeah, he did. Uh, what do you have equipped? Lunas Coat. Physical defense plus 11. Boots, Mega Medicine, Sacrifice of Jizo. Totally didn't just do that. Nope, nope, nope. Didn't steal it. He has a Great Hawk Rune. Well, I guess he uses a bow. Let's uh, check out his stats. Actually, we haven't checked out uh, Miyakis' stats, have we? Um, bees across the board in uh, all the magic skills. That's pretty good. Um, actually, we probably have checked her out. Sato is B sun, D fire, C lightning, B in wind and water, Earth, star. Um, uh, so from so is whatever. Um. B in Holy, B in Dark, uh, A in uh, Shoot, which was what the Great Hawk Rune uses. He's got the Barrage um, skill and Agility. And his weapon is the Daphne Bow. And he is, of course, a long range. Let's go ahead and save. As long as we're here. Just in case anything happens, we'll save over this one. Alright. Seriously, it's it's a beautiful place, and yet it's all dirt. We've been expecting you, your highness. I mean, it is pretty nice that it's, uh, you know, a town and a cliff face kind of thing. Bye, boys. There's another uh, save point down there. Interesting. In flashback to Suikoden 4. Out of my way, Leon. Jeez. Your Highness Princess, please see what the Oracle has to say first. Fine, fine, fine. We've been expecting you, Your Highness. Ooh, treasures. Almost missed them, because they're brown. A defense ring. And a jewel necklace. Eh, not too shabby. Please see what the Oracle has to say first. Is that through here? Oracle's Conclave... I guess so. Apparently there is nothing down there. Well, the Oracle could wait. Kitty! And please see what the Oracle has to say first. 
Fine, fine, fine. It's all dirt! Oracle, I've brought the princess and the others. Oh my goodness! I can't believe it! Oh, look how big you've gotten! D do I know you? Y your hair is the same color as mine. Well, let's, uh, let's totally be rude. Who are you? What? Oh, Ald, I'm hurt. You haven't forgotten me, have you? After all those baths we took to get- Whoa! Oh my! Um, uh, not- not in front of the ladies, please! What? what what Who do you think you are? Get your hands off of Ald! Lim, you're little Lim, aren't you? Huh? You're so cute! Oh my! Let go of me! Let go of me, I tell you! I'll do nothing of the sort! You're too cute! Well, Lady Hassar, it's nice to see that, you're s that you still love children as enthusiastically as ever. Don't tell me that woman is... Yep, meet the Oracle. Sh she's the Oracle? The one and only. Of course, she's just a cousin Haswar to Arshtat and me. What? Ah, so she is related. So when you said you took baths together... Oh goodness, of course I meant he was a baby. Whenever Arshtat was too busy, I got to babysit the little darling. I bet he was super cute back then, huh? What, are you saying I w I'm not super cute now? I am hurt, Lim. Nero's hoping for a good story. Nuts. Hey. And now that little pudge ball has turned into such a fine young man. And Lim's become an absolutely adorable little girl, too. My, my, I think my voice I was doing for her totally changed already. I just can't stand it. I want to keep the pair of you as my own. Well, you know, Mommy is kind of crazy, so, uh... Sure, if you volunteer to be Mother, you can do that. Uh... <laughs> nothing we'd like more. Excuse me, Oracle. I believe it's time to start preparations for the purification rite. Oh, is it that time already? Ah, oh, well. All right, Lim, let's take you to the back and start getting ready. Uh, okay. Don't be so nervous. There won't be anything difficult about it. And will you come help too, Mia Keys? Sure! Sorry, Ald, but you can't see her until she's ready. Do you think you'll be able to find something to do? Nah. Who am I kidding? Of course I will. You probably won't get many chances to visit Lunas again, so maybe you should have a look around while you're here. Seems like a good idea. Isato, show them around, okay? As you wish. I guess we go our separate ways, then. Lim, Miyakis, you come with me to the back. Thanks for your stuff, Miyakis. I could have tried on equipping that shield room. I might do that if I have an opportunity. I don't know if I'm going to have an opportunity. Eh, order seems okay for now. I'll... I don't think we're gonna get into any combats. Have you met with the Oracle, Your Highness? She's an extraordinary woman, isn't she? Um, if by extraordinary you mean extraordinarily hug... Uh, 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 huggy? I, I don't know what the proper term would be. Affectionate, yes. There we go. Ah, uh, Your Highness, I'm sorry, but I've got a lot of work to do at the moment. I'm afraid I can't help you right now. I hope you understand. I do not. You will help me. The princess and the oracle are getting ready for the purification rite. I'm afraid no gentlemen are allowed. Well, I'm no gentleman. Um, never mind. Kitty! Long, long ago, a beautiful woman descended from the heavens to Lunas, together with the sun room. She went on to become the very first queen of Helena. Because she descended here, Lunas is now known as the Holy Land. Interesting. So what do you say? Ah, your highness. Actually, I'm a bit overwhelmed seeing someone as important as you so close up. We don't get a lot of high-profile visitors here in Lunas. Uh, other than the fact that we always have to come here when we're 
you know, when, well, when the princess is getting married. I, I, well, I mean, it is a few years apart, I suppose. What do we have here? Your Highness, welcome to Lunas. How about something to drink? Sure, receive juice. Mmm, I love free stuff. Uh, let's see. So, one cheesecake recovers 50 hit points. Juice recovers a little hit points. Magic plus five for, five tur for three turns. Fruit punch has uh, recover a little hit points. Magic plus ten for three turns. I should sell this stuff. I don't know exactly how many uh, things I... Yeah, look at all these creeper beads I've got. Uh, defense ring, physical defense plus one. Jewel necklace, magic plus one. Oh, that's pretty good. I don't really have anyone with magic at the moment, though. Well, seal leads, I suppose. But... Old Book 5! Sweet! She doesn't exactly... I mean, I don't know. The Wind Rune, not my favorite. I don't like Wind of Sleep. Ah, uh, uh, your Highness, uh, did, did you want something? Nope, just wanted to interrupt you. You know, while I uh, loot these houses... Well, well, your highness, welcome. What, you don't have anything to give me? Jerk. I'm hurt. Maybe you guys should, uh... I don't know... Get something a little bit more sturdy than wood ramps everywhere? Ah, oh, your highness, I expect you've noticed that what a hilly place Lunas is. I love my homeland, of course. But all the ups and downs are starting to take their toll on my knees. I can imagine. Whee! Is that? Yeah, it's just reflection. Well, it looks like we're getting something here. Oh. Prince? <laughs> Don't make me laugh. What? Hold it. Totally kick his butt. What's with that kind of attitude? You're being very rude to His Highness the Prince and Lady Seelids. But, but Isato, they have no right to their titles. The Oracle is the one who should have been queen. Enough! The Oracle does not wish to be queen. You should know that. Hmm. If you'll excuse me. No! Let's push him in the water, Leon. Let's do it. I'm very sorry about that. Please pardon his lack of courtesy. Nope. What did he mean by all that? Forgive me, I'm afraid it is not my place to say. It was a conflict over the throne. Shouldn't I know all of this? We wanted to keep it a secret from you and Lim. Oh. But you're old enough to know the truth now. Georg, have you heard of Nethergate? <gasps> Nether what? Nethergate. It means the entrance to hell. I'm not sure that that's exactly what it means. It's the name of... An it's the name of an assassin group, once under the direct control of the Queen. Oh yeah, now that you mention it, I did hear about it once, a long time ago. But I've never seen any sign of the group in Felena, so I figured it was just a nasty rumor. It doesn't exist anymore. Arshtat broke the organization up. Uh, something tells me that that's not actually accurate. Or at least, accurate anymore. So before that, it really did exist. After all, you know, they wouldn't be bringing these things up if they weren't going to be relevant in the game in the future. Yes, it was a covert force that did terrible things to support the power of the Flanian royal family. Sometimes they were even asked to turn their weapons on members of the royal family itself. About 20 years ago, two sisters fought over the Queen's throne. Each sister was backed by powerful nobles and senators. Civil war seemed inevitable. And then, both of them started hiring Nethergate assassins to kill members of the other side. Senators and nobles were found dead. The husbands of both sisters were assassinated, too. Finally, the older sister couldn't take it anymore. She surrendered the right of succession to the younger sister. Once the younger sister legally became queen, the first thing she did was have Nethergate kill her sister. That older sister was Cousin Haswar's mother. The younger sister was Arshtat's and my mother, the previous queen. Arshtat, Cousin Haswar, and I all watched that horrible conflict. 
So when the previous queen suddenly died after only two years on the throne, we made a pact. Haswar and I abdicated any right of succession, and we both vowed to never get married or have children. Arshtat then joined with Farad to break up Nethergate. We all made a few sacrifices to avoid civil war. It's not the bloodiest tale of royal succession I've heard. So it wasn't the previous queen, but actually the previous queen's older sister who should have taken who should have taken over. And by that line, the following queen would have would have would have, of course, been Lady Haswar, the older sister's daughter. But then I have absolutely no interest in the throne, so I can't see what all the fuss is about. Oh, hi, Auntie Haswar. I guess, yeah, Auntie. Oracle. Would she be a, No, she'd be a cousin. Not an aunt. I would call her an aunt. I realized this story might come out, so I came looking for you. I'm so sorry you had to find out about it like this. I don't see why this way is any worse than other ways that we could have, or... Don't get too upset about it, okay? Why would I be upset? Thank you. I'm glad Arshtat became queen myself. Right after the previous queen died, Armus ruthlessly attacked us. And the only reason we managed to hold out was because Arshtat did such a wonderful job as queen. If I had been the queen, we would all be the subjects of Armus right about now. Well, at least you recognize it. What? Isn't anyone going to disagree? Huh? F forgive us, uh, of course, none of us think that. Just kidding. <laughs> uh, oh. Cousin Haswar. Well, shall we head back? Lim should be just about done with her meditation exercise. Wait, wait, I, I, I wanted to go inside the buildings. Ooh, options. Uh, you coming, Le Leon? Oh, yes, I'm coming, Your Highness. Uh, we're leaving without you. Ah, oh, it's the same basic thing. I like the other one better. I don't think it makes a difference. Uh, let's see. Uh... Doesn't look like it matters. Oh, good. We can go talk to other people. Can't talk to that one jerk guy though. Judging by the amount of gold dust that washes down here, there must be a large there must be large gold deposits upstream. But if we allowed gold mining, the forest would be chopped down and the river polluted practically overnight. It'd be too damaging to the Holy Land. That's why, for generations, the Queen has always refused to allow mining. Something tells me that the uh, uh, Barrows and Godwins would be more than happy to uh, see that edict reversed. There are some nobles pushing hard to get permission to mine here. I think it's a disgraceful idea. Puppy! Um, no, not, not you, Leon. Yeah, it's nothing. No need to worry, really. Puppy! Oh, I'm so busy playing with this dog! Lunas is a very small population, so we have... So when we have any visitors, things get very hectic. Really? Okay, you say so. Well, let's go check out these, uh, buildings. Or rooms. It's no exaggeration to say that Lunas' history is the history of the Flanagan royal family. It's that important. this, uh, uh, fenced-off portion is. Doesn't appear to be anything in here that we can, uh, interact with. Ooh, treasure chest. A magical piece! Magical piece? Magical orb. I assume that's like the, uh, wizard orb? I don't know, I'll have to go look that up, maybe. Old book. Now, if someone could read it. Anything? Ooh, goody. Another church chest. Gimme, gimme, gimme. A water orb. That's kind of useful. 
How about you take part in the purification rite, your highness? <laughs> a bad joke, I know. W what's that supposed to mean? You know I don't know anything about the purification rite, don't you? I, I kind of figure, you know, if this place, you know, gets spring floods, you know, from uh, um, uh, snow melt, I would think that all of these rooms here uh, would just get completely flooded out. Probably not even spring floods, just heavy rainstorms would probably do it. Uh, Hassar doesn't have any support uh, abilities, unfortunately. We will now begin the purification rite. I'm sorry, but I'm afraid the men will have to leave. Just one of those things. Oh. Oh, no peeking. Why would I want to peek? Oh. -ho -ho. <laughs> Why would I want to peek at you? What? Oh, what's that supposed to mean? Oh, that's just wrong. I'm not going to keep that one. Of course I won't. Oh, well, I, I didn't think you would, of course. Hmm? Don't tell me you want him to peek, princess. You, uh... You have a little bit too much of an infatuation with your brother, kiddo. D don't be ridiculous! Why would I want him to peek? It, it's just that, well, I, I thought I might feel kind of lonely all by myself. Don't worry, Lim. They call it a rite, but it's really mostly like... It, it's really mostly like a bath. Besides, Lady Sealeads and I will be right beside you. Hear that, old? Are you really sure you don't want to peek? Eh, pretty sure. <laughs> I'm not even sure which one of these is a uh, smart one. Uh... Let's see. Let me let me just double check. Um, oh, this is gonna be good. So uh, let's just stay silent, Prince. Oh, we made Leon angry. I I was just kidding. But right, of course you were kidding. What a relief. Wait, 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 let's see what the other option is. Aren't you going to be there, Leon? Uh, I'll be guarding you, Prince! <laughs> Very sure. <laughs> so unadventurous. I wouldn't really mind if you peeked just a little. Aunt Sia leads! Lady Sia leads. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, you know what? I think I figured out why Kyle isn't here. <laughs> I think we, I think we have, we have discovered the reason why Kyle is not al was not allowed on this trip. <laughs> well, we'd better leave. The ride is about to start. Could you, Isato? As you wish. This way, please. Oh, oh, don't go to bed before we get back. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to bed before you. I'm pretty sure I have a later, uh, uh, bedtime. Oh, you know what? We're going way over on this, uh, uh episode. I, I forgot that the timer went off. Now I see why Farad wouldn't let Kyle come with us. <laughs> exactly! I think I would trade his life for one peek at that bath. I, I bet you're right. Sea Leeds left the party. Aswar left the party. Well, if we get control back, then I'll, uh, I'll break the episode. There we go. Okay, yes. Good time to break it, and there is actually a save point here. So let's go ahead and make use of that. And in the next episode, um, maybe we'll see if we can uh, try peeking. The, the, the entranceway is right there. See you all next time, everyone.